Hi, I'm Summer Whitehouse. I'm the STP Director uh, for Together We're Better, which is the health and care partnership across Staffordshire and Stoke-on-Trent. Really just want to talk to you for a couple of minutes about uh, some of the achievements of 2019 uh, and recognise uh, the work that's taken place across the health and care partnership uh, over, that, uh, over the past year. Whilst I talk about the really positive things, let's recognise we've still got some really key and, and difficult challenges uh, that we need to be working through. Part of that then is supported by the publication of the long-term plan. So we've worked really hard as a system to build on the 2016 plan uh, and there's a long-term plan uh, that will be published hopefully in early 2020 uh, that will show what the next four or five years uh, look like from a, from a health and care system. Uh, underpinning that though is the work and the, and the achievements that have happened. We've had a real focus on leadership and workforce development uh, across Staffordshire and Stoke-on-Trent in 2019. Done some really strong work around uh, black uh, and minority ethnic groups in terms of their potential and, and supporting them in terms of their, their development. Also been fortunate to work with the Leadership Academy on the, on the high potential uh, scheme. Uh, we're one of the early, if not the earliest, STP uh, to work with the Leadership Academy to bring that scheme across Staffordshire and Stoke-on-Trent, supporting some of our key individuals and key leaders to really maximise their, their potential and their performance and hopefully to keep them working in the health and care system in Staffordshire and, and Stoke-on-Trent. Also had a big chunk of work around the digital agenda uh, in 2019. Really excited about what the potential is in terms of the NHS app and its use uh, uh, for our population, uh, but equally uh, the integrated care record, uh, the procurement and the work around that to, to get to a point where the system across Staffordshire and Stoke-on-Trent and individuals uh, have a care record that works across partners. Uh, so hopefully you tell your story once and you don't need to keep telling your story over and over again every time you engage with a different part of the, part of the system. At the same time, whilst the digital agenda is going to be really important moving forward, uh, we continue to look to attract as much capital money as we can. Uh, so the capital money enables us to develop our estates, uh, our, our buildings uh, and make sure they're fit for purpose for 2020 onwards. At the same time, we had a really successful second uh, suicide conference, uh, significant numbers of people turning up and a lot of support from voluntary and third sector uh, as well as from the, the statutory organisations and that's an agenda that we're going to push really hard on, on going forward in terms of how do we reduce and what's our ambition really uh, for, for zero suicides across Staffordshire and, and Stoke-on-Trent. Uh, so, so lots of work around leadership, lots of work in terms of uh, uh, digital agenda, lots of estate work uh, and lots of work in terms of uh, the, the mental health agenda. There's also a lot of work taking place in terms of urgent and emergency care and elective care and uh, real focus on how do partners work together as as a system rather than individual organisations. Uh, it sounds really easy as I sit here and say that, uh, but a significant chunk of work that needs to happen around that as we develop a, a health and care system and model of care that's sustainable uh, and that works for the population that we serve across Staffordshire and Stoke-on-Trent.